You're watching KALB News Channel 5. We're online anytime at KALB.com. The St. Joseph Eagles basketball team may not have won too many games this season, but it's one of the games they lost that they will remember forever. It's because of the kindness of their opponent and the triumph of their own teammate. I went to Plosheville for the story. Take a look. He shoots. He misses. But the ball is thrown back to him. Try it again. That's exactly what 15-year-old Colton Dupuy had the chance to do at the big game this month. Amazed and surprised. Colton is a proud member of the St. Joseph's Eagles. He's also on the autism spectrum. Colton is very determined. Like the rest of us, he always has down moments, but he always rebounds and bounces back. The Eagles were losing this game to the Elizabeth Bulldogs when the Bulldogs in the last quarter started passing the ball to Colton, an Eagle, allowing him to shoot again and again. It was amazing, that's all I can say though. At one point I really thought that I was just dreaming, this isn't happening, and it, every play over and over again. And 22 points later, and the crowd goes wild. Eagles and Bulldogs alike. For Colton's coach, it's compassion. It's kind of showing them how things are done the right way. A lot about sportsmanship uh, and just love in general for opponents, uh, teammates. For Colton's parents, it's hope for the future. I always worried how Colton would adapt to the world as he grew up. But since watching him play basketball, I've really, I don't worry as much about how his future will be. And for Colton, yeah. it's just a game. How does it feel to be out on that court? Awesome. St. Joseph may not be in the playoffs, but they still have a team that they're mm -hmm. cheering for. Colton's parents told me that the Eagles are now the Elizabeth Bulldogs' number one fans. Yeah, victory comes in different ways. It I does.